Hello everybody, welcome to Friday Night Stand Firm. I'm Jimmy Ventura. In the booth with me is Gorilla Metal. Good afternoon, good evening everyone. Gorilla Metal in the house. Cannot wait for episode two of the rebranded, revived Friday Night Stand Firm. And we're in Alamo Gordo, New Mexico. That's right. I've never heard of that town in my life. <laughs> but <laughs> here we are. And yeah, we had a bit of a rocky first event, I'm not going to lie. But I think tonight is going to take us to a new level. We could crown new tag team champs in the JFW. And in the opening match tonight, we are going to find out who is going to be competing against Dress for Business for the Two Heads Championships later on this Jimmy evening. Fantastic That's right, it's our two brand new minted tag teams. Last week, both victorious. It is Tri F -f -f -k 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 1K and good day, Nick. And Jim, I hear they're calling themselves something now. What is it? <laughs> it is uh, it is Mad Cat Girl Loving Weebs. <laughs> Mad cat girl loving weebs. Fair enough. You know, you, clearly Nick just uh, let Try fill out all the forms for them as they uh, officially signed on as a tag team. And over on the other side, we also got these two looked real good in their domination over a very lost winner 3 5. It's uh, Calcium Kaz and Flicky Flack, and they too have a new name, don't they? Yes, they are Blind Fury. <laughs> Blind Fury. Why would they call themselves that? That doesn't make any sense. You'd think PC would be involved there. Yeah, you'd think so, wouldn't you? I don't know what the idea is for that. Interesting. Well, here we go. Let's get to ringside. And here they are, the cat fucking duo of tentacle pornos or whatever they're called. The mad cat girl loving weaves. Excuse me. <laughs> Oh, boy. I feel like Try is having a bad influence on G'day Nick, the American hero here. It looks like it, yeah. <laughs> but they look happy to be here. Oh, dear. Oh, no. Oh, that's... That's you right there in the ring right now. You've got as many SFL championships standing in that ring as Skurametso has one on his own. <laughs> Two-time winner Gudenik, one-time winner Tri Fifik, and uh, zero-time tag team champs. They're looking to add that to their resume. Yeah. <laughs> oh, <cat> eh? <laughs> And here they are, it's Blind Fury, Calcium Kaz, and Flicky Flack. <laughs> oh, I think Flicky Flack's looking maybe to try and like look cool or something wearing sunglasses, is that it? <laughs> that might be it. <laughs> I think it might be because he's pretending to be blind. <laughs> well, if he's, if he's trying to pretend to be blind, I think... Uh, <laughs> I think he's got to take some acting lessons, let me just say that. Let's hope he doesn't walk into the ring post. <laughs> <laughs> Indeed. <laughs> well, you know, sometimes when uh, tag teams are trying to make an impact, and these guys could be tag team champs in just a couple hours, uh, they try and find some something to set them apart from the pack. <laughs> And I'm not entirely sure what they're going for here, but Flicky, Flicky coming out and trying to trying to show his acting skills off as a blind man is about to get uh, bent over by a cat lady. Try here we go. No, oh yep, try ducking that clothesline and giving one of his own, and try off to a hot start here. But Flicky right back up, kick to the midriff, and ow, oh, he dumps him out, but Flicky hangs on. And right back into the ring, he goes the hard way. Big oh. suplex by Tri. Oof. Oh, man, Tri. Tri and Gadenic both with the cat ears. <laughs> He's got meow. He's no longer got sus. <laughs> he is fully on board with the cat, the cat girl 
weeb loving, isn't that lovely? <laughs> Sorry, I, I was just getting a text from a uh, mildly famous human being. Oh. Yeah, I know. I'm, I'm a busy guy. What can I say? Busy guy. Glorious. Anyway, back to the action here. They can uh, they can wait. We've got stand firm right now. <laughs> they, they probably can't wait too long. <laughs> <laughs> Day Nick, uh, Day Nick getting uh, getting the Boston Crab on showing off. He's a a, a Amer across America kind of person. Starting up in the northeast, and let's see if he goes down south on calcium here. Oh, God. <laughs> Tony! <laughs> uh, well, first of all, I'm Gorilla Mezzo. Skurro might be in the chat, but uh, he is uh, not the same person. Yep, definitely two completely different people I like that. Yeah, I don't actually have a chat, a chat or a, a Twitch account of my own because uh, I, well, I don't need one. Whenever I come to Twitch, I'm such a hot commodity. I'm on comms, baby. <laughs> oh, yeah. And here we go, Calcium taking it to G'day Nick. G'day Nick sporting those uh, blue cat ears. That's a, uh, that might be distracting for his partner. <laughs> yeah, it might be. <laughs> try, but tr will try and be in a rush to show off his small package once he sees those cat ears. That's the question, I guess. That is true, yes. Oh, well, he's eager to get in the ring. It sure is, and look at this. Ooh, beautiful. Nice teamwork there, and they showed it last week. They're showing it again. They know how to work together, but not how to prevent an easy tag. <laughs> and then tried his stance there for the big boot and the standing drop kick. Wow. Flicky on fire and Flicky. Nope, Flicky fucked. <laughs> he walked right into that one, did Flicky. He sure did. Here goes the tag to Calcium back in the ring. Boot to the midsection. Client client just sent me a picture being like, can we do something like this? And I'm like, that's an Annie Leibovitz portrait. She's one of the most famous and best portrait photographers on the planet. <laughs> so no, probably not. <laughs> 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 Sorry, I'm distracted. All right, we're back into it now, though. <laughs> And uh, again, we are finding out who is going into the main event later tonight to face the newly crowned Lemon is Good and Fan Fox of Dressed for Business for the Two Heads Championships. Yep, it's going to be a wild one. Oh, Calcium, yep, Calcium stops him tagging in Nick. Great play. Brutal move, wearing down, wearing down try. Let's <laughs> see, look. Oh, look at this. I love that duplex. That's something. And yeah, it fired up calcium as well. And now, Blind Fury is, uh, is on fire here. Boy, howdy. The tag, quick tags. These these yeah. weebs are uh, got some good really, teamwork. Both uh, both teams really showing showing up here tonight as tag teams. Again, something that we weren't sure how it would work out. Just kind of throwing, uh, you know, uh, eight guys, you know, into pairs of two last week, and obviously it only worked out for half those teams. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> <laughs> but uh, but these guys really show, and they they are in this, and uh, we could have a really special main event on our hands tonight for those tag two heads titles. Oh, beautiful power slam there! Devastating. He's got a bit confused with the ropes here. Yeah, though, Nick. yeah, he's got to be careful there. Those ropes. Okay, he gets through it, but it was enough to hang him up. Flicky gets the counter and the big back body drop. Oh, look out! Oh! Oh! The counter! What a counter by the American hero, Gaden! Excuse me. Howdy, Nick. 
And he's just kind of grinding up on him there. And that might make Flicky submit. <laughs> That's amazing. What a maneuver. Oh, there it is. Oh, Big wow. Uranagi slam. Say your dumb joke. Uh, Unagi. There you go. <laughs> <laughs> Flicky. Uh oh, well, you're not gonna like this one even more, Flicky. Yep. Look out. It's and the there it is, he's locked it in, the koala clutch. Oh boy. Oh, instant. Instant. Oh uh, yeah, the, the power of the blind the quote unquote blind man himself. <laughs> yeah, he's he's dispensed with a charade after the entrance, I see. Oh my god, brutal. Yeah, well, I mean, he's not a method actor, Jim. <laughs> Oof. Or any kind of actor, I should say. <laughs> oh, dude. oh, here we go. The flak yeah, hammer. Flak hammer coming. Boosh. A lamp post slam, baby. <laughs> oh, oh calcium and calcium just got a little confused there, a little slow on the uptick to get the the, the meow adorned ass of try. <laughs> oh, look out! Oof. Howdy, Nick. Flicky Flack is Oof. on Flicky Fire. Oh my god, he's just devastating Nick here. And a two count kick out once again. <laughs> yeah, purely belt. <laughs> I'm being told something about purely. What, what's the show called? Purely. Purely belter. That's the yeah, movie. Yeah, Shirley Belter, yeah, I, I'm, I'm being told it's, uh, that's, I'm being told there might be a revival of that movie and Flicky Flack is, uh, looking at, looking to reprise his childhood role after, you know, 20 plus years of not acting. <laughs> well, he chose a, he chose a weird way to pitch a, chose, chose a weird way to pitch it by <laughs> pretending to be blind down the ramp and then, I mean, I can't make this plot sound good. <laughs> About as good, I'm about as good as Flicky's ever been in, uh, in, in, in on screen. Oh, this is. Remember when I said that sometimes we just go off the rails, Jim? Yeah. <laughs> I, mean, I don't think we made this one happen. <laughs> oh, dude. Well, here we go. Here That's we another go. Flick hammer. Yeah, if Fl Flicky doesn't care about what's going on in the booth, he only cares about the ring because he's got titles awaiting him in the main event. Oh. No, Nick in to break it up, and again, Calcium slow. Oh, Calcium <laughs> fought his way through Flicky to get to Nick, and that's the kind of partner Calcium's always been, and that's why his partners generally seek other people, if you know what I mean. <laughs> oh, dude. <laughs> I don't want you to talk about on Full Scroll, dude. This is Gorilla yeah. Metal. Well, oh, it's not even Skuro, just Skuo. <laughs> Skuo. <laughs> the Skynamic Skuo. That's going to save this all. If everything happened just to get to that, we're good. Holy shit, that's amazing. Oh, and look Kekuri. out! Kekuri, no, Try might be... have that! Trying to swap oh. back and get hit by Calcium, and the pin is broken up. Oh no, look out! Uh, I thought he was going for the full on try a Rooney. Tentacle Rooney. <laughs> Tentacle Rooney! Oh man, the Oh, I just. Oh no, I thought they were the tag teams. Oh my god, I thought that was flicky. I thought it was flicky. I've gone blind, sorry. <laughs> this is. <laughs> this is Perhaps a fucking we're still disaster. Out, we're, st we're still working out the kinks. <laughs> so, so, so I'm trying, Nick. <laughs> oh, dear. Yeah, I should have given them an octopus stretch, right? For the tentacles. 
Well, this match continues in try, and Howdy Nick looking a lot better now. Ooh. Oh, oh try. Try, though, looking to do something nefarious by unbuckling that turnbuckle and probably doing nothing else with it. No, look nope, out! Straight into oh, it! Right into it! And that has taken Ooh. something out of the not so blind man. <laughs> Oh, and right back in it, he gives uh, gives Howdy Nick a little bit of comeuppance there and then hangs him up on the ropes here. What's he got for him? Let's hope it's anything oh. except old school. Yep, it is. Look at oh, him. Oh, my gosh. <laughs> He's just trying to remind Nick of the last time that he was living and they faced each other, I guess. Yeah. Yeah, Nick has Nick got to be out for revenge here a little bit, hasn't he? Yeah. Oh, look out, and this could be the revenge. And it is. Oh, oh. no. Both men bleeding now. Try tagged in. <laughs> We've seen this before. Ah, <laughs> oh, Try too busy looking at his uh, tentacle hands to stop <laughs> the tag there. Yep, just imagining later tonight when he... <laughs> yep. <laughs> what he's going to do with that right hand. <laughs> Here he goes. He's going to fly oh. right now, though. Look at this. Oh, Holy what shit. the fuck was that? <laughs> God knows. This slow motion senton. <laughs> oh, dirty pin. Dirty pin with the refs distracted by his own turnbuckle. Ref <laughs> has to have seen that. <laughs> Jesus Christ. <laughs> uh, ref's the blind one in this one, I think. <laughs> oh, fuck it. What a maneuver from Kaz. Indeed, into the pin, but Flicky not paying attention. Oh. Maybe he is a method actor. <laughs> oh. Uh-oh. Ref still distracted no. by a turnbuckle. Nice counter. Will we see him try small package? No, the half Boston crab. <laughs> Devastating half crab. <laughs> yeah, not tonight it's not. And calcium has gotten out of it. Calcium running into a knee there, and Try gonna fly again. Oh boy. Same thing. <laughs> <laughs> no comment, Flicky. <laughs> sort of the best. <laughs> oh dear. Uh, here we go. Look at that big axe handle chop to the arm and right into a German Ooh. suplex. And he hangs on. Oh, we're going to see. Oh, look at this. No. Oh. Full Nelson suplex. What's the third going to be? Oh. Another German into the pin. Beautiful. He's got him. He's got him. Look at that. What domination by the bad cat loving weaves. <laughs> <laughs> and they are going to the main event to face dressed for business Fan Fox oh gosh look out Fan Fox <laughs> Fan Fox and Lemon is good Fan Fox might be the target of uh, tries um, well you know and uh, yeah. but the but more importantly than ejaculation the two heads titles are on the line in that match later on tonight Congratulations, <laughs> Try and Howdy Nick. Boy, Howdy. That's the good thing. Oh, dude. <laughs> Fan Fox already preparing his uh, special parts, I think. <laughs> oh, God. Yep. Well, there you go. Great performance by those two. And, yep, they've got themselves a shot at the titles. Fan Fox, may I may I may I recommend putting your jock strap and cup on backwards for that match? <laughs> and next up, we have singles action. Two guys looking to kickstart their careers: Satterfield and Foxamania. Both of them successful tag guys looking to go it alone. Obviously, Foxamania has been a singles champion before. It has been a while, and uh, you know. JBG recently coming back. Foxmania maybe looking to forge out and make uh, make his solo career known. And here we go. Satterfield versus Foxmania is next. Glorious.
<laughs> I guess that is the implication. Yes, squirrel dude, but nothing. I, 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 don't, I don't know what you're talking about. I'm just trying to tell him how to properly maintain his sporting equipment. Okay, good. Making his way to the ring. <laughs> Oh, Jesus. <laughs> <laughs> I forgot about that. Yeah, it's pretty it great. It sure has been a while. The big man's got big ups and little feet. It is Satterfield. And surely he will be rolling, rolling, rolling. It is Yorkshire's own Boxamania. Been a while since we've seen this entrance as well. I know. Two long time tag team specialists. Yep. Stand firm. We uh, we want to give everyone a shot. We want to we want to reset the wrestling world, right? Start from scratch. Build up another empire. You know, I did it once to help the JFW become what it was, and then it started falling into shambles, so they brought me right back to fix it, and here I am. Glorious. Very hairy, isn't he? <laughs> he is incredibly hairy. I, it could be road rash. We don't know how good he is on that motorcycle when he's not going four miles an hour down a single ramp, but... <laughs> It's not JFEG. <laughs> oh, and they run right into each other. That was probably a bad plan by Fox Media into the much larger man, Satterfield. Yeah. In with the big kick, little foot. I don't know how much damage. That's very focused damage, I guess. Yeah. Oh. Pounds vicious. for square inch, as it were, is. Uh... <laughs> yes. <laughs> oh. What a maneuver. You can tell you can tell it's not JBG because it says Fox and on his ass. No it doesn't. It says your chew. Damn it. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> yeah. We have no idea who this unmasked man is. <laughs> Could it be a fake beard? <laughs> oh no. Satterfield, we do know who he is, the very big former security guard is manhandling Foxmania right now. And of course, as I say that, Foxmania manhandled Satterfield. <laughs> His name is Yorkshire. We have no, we have nothing to prove otherwise. Yeah. <laughs> and he's got- He says it on his, his fucking ham hock thighs. <laughs> And also, no other human on the planet could wear that shirt and not be Satterfield. <laughs> yeah. <sighs> One count kick out. Satterfield in a little bit of trouble here, though. Obviously, a speed advantage and a technical wrestling advantage going uh, to Foxmania. Yeah. <laughs> Sorry, I'm really tired. <laughs> That's all right. I have not been uh, carrying the show on my own anyway. He's <laughs> <laughs> got a back air advantage as well. Yeah, yeah it's true. like body armor. <laughs> oh, slips out. Smart maneuver by Satterfield. Going to go get himself kind of collected. This is a big moment. This is normally when he'd probably want to tag out. Oh, but he's got to pay attention. <laughs> and it looks like he fell before the punch came there. Yeah. Oh, wow. You've oh, been no. But brawling right back, ref is counting. There is a count out in this match, which God help us if we have one. <laughs> Fox Mania, I mean, obviously he can't get him to submit on the uh, on the outside. No, he but... can't. But he but he can get him to uh, not be able to walk back in the ring. Looks like he had no effect whatsoever. <laughs> Barely an inconvenience. <laughs> yep. Up to seven. Oh, Jesus Christ. Uh, the eight the eight counts a long break, though. Yeah, Satterfield knows. <laughs> if there's a counter here, we're in trouble, though. Yeah. He might get him anyway. He oh, might get him. Oh, here. yeah, he's going to get him. Oh, he definitely is. Oh, no. <laughs> well. 
son of a All woman. right, I, I, I promise you folks, we're not, Stan Firm isn't just going to be a collection of uh, entrance run-ins and count-outs. We'll have <laughs> real matches from time to time, too. But it looks like we just had yet another count-out of Satterfield getting a big singles wing and over a former champion. Yeah. Friday night. Yeah, Friday night count-out, yeah. yeah. <laughs> Satterfield just knew his pathing better than Foxmania, clearly. <laughs> Holy shit. Yep, the pathing, that is, that is it. Here is your winner. <laughs> no, not only Cage. <laughs> no, Cage matches are even worse. I'd yeah. rather have countouts. Yeah, extreme, just extreme rules. Everything's extreme rules. <laughs> oh, dear. Well... Like I said, we have real matches too, I promise. Yeah. But Satterfield standing tall tonight, and what a start for him in the Friday Stand Firm and JFW Universe as a singles act. Yep. Oh, baby. Glorious. And, oh boy, here we go. We've got the two losers from last week. Uh, yeah, the redemption match. Skirmezzo and Johnny Five, they are the winner of three fives. <laughs> against Crusher and EAB. <laughs> and if not for last week, I'd be like, well, this might be it for the winner three fives. But it's not like Crusher and EAB came out and dominated either. So this is anyone's game here. Yeah. I mean, I'd still rather be still rather, rather be teaming with Crusher or EAB, but yeah. <laughs> You're just saying that because of the size of their respective penises, probably. Yes. You got me. You got me, Gorilla. You got me. The, I, all, all I'll say is the winner three fives are both a descriptor and an accurate uh, representation of certain uh, appendages. All right, so what? One's, one's got a three inch and one's got a five inch. <laughs> the debate can rage in chat as we get to ringside <laughs> for this tag team redemption match. <laughs> Let's go to ringside. <laughs> Oh, thanks, thanks, Muppet. Thanks. Definitely my joke. <laughs> and he, oh, just coming out alone, Skirmetso. Not quite embracing the uh, the tag team world yet. Yeah, that might be that might be a sign of frustration by them. Not coming out. Not maybe not even on the same page yet. And they're gonna have to figure something out. A big win here might help though. Create some team unity. It's Skirmezzo first, and then Johnny Five. Can they get it together? Pro Good probably question. not. Yep. <laughs> Good question. Probably not. <laughs> <laughs> but he looks fired up and ready to go, and he is the SFL three-time champion. He won. Season three, season five, and season eight. He is Skiramezzo. And uh, could have a very story JFW career if like four other wrestlers didn't exist. Yep. Yep. <laughs> oh, dude. But he has been the champion before. Yeah, well, one day of championship for him. <laughs> and he's got he's got a great he's got a great entrance. A Royal Rumble winner from the uh, the Skiramezzo High Intensity Tournament, winning that uh, Royal Rumble completely on his own and not because he booked the show. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> oh dear. And his partner from Chicago. <laughs> There he is, Johnny Five. <laughs> looking, looking like, uh, looking like that guy. Remember that guy, Mister E? Who was oh, that yeah. guy? Yeah. A bit like him. Hi, I'm Jeff, but you can call me Nick. They'd invariably ask me why I go by Nick if my name is Jeff. And I got to tell them that it stands for nine inch cock. And then they'd either go away writing me off as an ass. Or only once they'd stick around to find out if it was true. The one that I was taught, the one that I was taught from a uh, a former British uh, regional manager. No, sorry, he was uh, just like a GM from uh, from the UK uh, at GW, but he was in town visiting, 
And we went out, and he's like, you know what the best pickup line on the planet is? What? And you go up, he's like, just walk up to a girl and be like, what do you do for a living? And then when she tells you, you're like, oh, that's cool. I train dolphins. And I tried it without thinking about it too hard. And she's like, oh, really? What does that entail? And I was like, I don't know. <laughs> and it didn't work at all. <laughs> Didn't even get a pity though. <laughs> and he didn't tell you what to do afterwards. He just said use that. <laughs> yeah. I think he was uh, banking on uh, one of his top salesmen of uh, tiny toy soldiers being able to improvise. <laughs> but what he failed to realize <laughs> was that one of his top salesmen selling tiny toy soldiers was not so good at talking to the opposite sex. <laughs> That's like the, up there for the worst advice ever, isn't it? <laughs> what the fuck? <laughs> I do it in the nude, J5. I don't. You don't need a wetsuit if you don't get cold. <laughs> I do like fish. That's <laughs> I don't even have a 60% with me. <laughs> I mean, Skuro does it. <laughs> oh, Part of that involves having to play CCL, but here we go. Let's not get too distracted by terrible pickup lines yeah. and, and the failed sexual exploits <laughs> of Skuromezzo in his young 20s. <laughs> it's EAB, and he's here for another tag match with Crutcher. <laughs> Jesus, Jeff. <laughs> <laughs> You should ask a Geordie, they've probably done it. <laughs> I was gonna say, how many women have you punched in the face? Just compare it to that. <laughs> oh, dear, yeah. You probably wouldn't give a shit, would it? Well, I mean, isn't that how they kill things? They ram they ram them with their faces? Yeah, yeah, I think it just wouldn't do a like, That's how they fight sharks. I, I think you'd probably break your hand. Yeah. Crusher. Four. Oh my god, he's so much bigger. Look at this. <laughs> oh well, god. again, as as the winner three fives know, size isn't everything. <laughs> Do I wish I told him? Oh god. <laughs> Bezel, ban yourself. Time yourself out for 30 seconds, Bezel. No, no bueno. He can't. He can't do that. Then I'd have to re. I'd have to remod him. So. <laughs> Fair enough. You'll have to spam it away. You'll have to spam it away. <laughs> this is going great. What a show we've got for you, folks. <laughs> I shouldn't have said that, should I? <laughs> <laughs> well, uh, back to the ringside action. Skrull getting, um, what's another word for uh, pounded into submission? <laughs> Damn it. Oh, Jesus. All right, so here comes J5 tagging in. Okay. Zubaz pants and all. He's got the big uh, original extra arms belt champion to contend with and he is overpowered instantly oh god what a chill <laughs> oh my god i don't think so pen you didn't i just think it was like just a bit of a twig or something oh well as someone who's been to nessie land i can tell you that it has to be a real monster and nothing else. Yeah, it just has to be. Because otherwise, like, 45 poor Scotsmen would be out of a job. <laughs> oh, look at this from JFIs! Oh, look at <laughs> 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 oh, 
J5 getting us momentarily excited for a big move <laughs> and just coming up empty. Holy shit. <laughs> Yeah, scientist speculating is no better than any other fucker speculating, is it? Oh my god, EAB kills the referee. <laughs> yeah, probably probably J5, a scientist who didn't understand that a lock wasn't attached to the ocean. <laughs> oh. oh, there we go. He makes that one connect. Standing uh, Moonsault and tags in Skuro to uh, maybe finish off EAB here. <laughs> Skuro will finish off anything. And he sure will. Get his hands on. <laughs> Let me tell you, he's got tiny fucking hands. <laughs> I, thought, I thought it was a sturgeon. I thought people thought it was a stir, like a really big sturgeon. <laughs> Everything looks like a really big sturgeon if it's in the hands of Skirometsal. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, yeah. <laughs> No. Oh, counters that. Skuro into the corner and desperately fighting his way out. And look at that. Oh, oh he's got the, the cannonball on him. Good. Crowds are fresh. I mean, some some fish like uh, like salmon can be both. Mm. Don't pretend you know how to fish. <laughs> I I have no idea how to fish. I just know how to eat fish. Mm, it's just the it was just the thing one of the Tom Schnitz thing. Oh, oh, oh. Yep, squig on a stick. That's the that was the joke. <laughs> Jesus Christ. <laughs> 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 Buy him dinner first, Jesus. <laughs> For the power of Crusher. Oof. Yeah, indeed. Crusher making the most of his brief time in the ring there. Absolutely tormenting Skuro right now. And here's a pinfall, but J5 should be, well, not even bothered. Skuro kicks out a one. Oh, wow. Looks desperate to get in the ring, J5, but he's. Uh... Wasn't wasn't offering the tag. <laughs> if uh, if someone's hand, oh gosh, big military press. Oh, I thought he's going out of the ring for a minute. There, that would have killed him. Yep. Oh. Uh, oh, the spear! No, he countered it. Yeah. Countered the spear into a DDT. But here's the AB, and uh, Skuro looks like he's going for a pin here. No. Nope. J five. Nah, he's just gonna hang out. Nah, he's just hanging. <laughs> it's all good. Yeah, why not? Just stand there. Come on. <laughs> <laughs> hey, Crasher. Oh, not the real Crusher. <laughs> if we haven't, yeah, yeah, I did too. If we have an, uh, an ad, you know, an admin in chat right now, I think uh, our betting, uh, our betting topic for this entire show should just be, <laughs> will this get demonetized on YouTube? <laughs> Oh, here we go. Pump handle shoulder breaker. And he has won matches with that before. Is he going for the pit? Nah. Nah. <laughs> Come nah. on. <laughs> Come on. <laughs> He's got him by the horns, though, and he slams his head into the ground, stomping on the midsection. Skuro firing himself up now, but he has had a, uh, we'll just call it a deliberate pace before this moment. <laughs> Oh well, he no. I thought that, I thought that was going to be the proper power bomb there. Yeah, yeah, both both fair points. <laughs> no, it was a it was a pop down winded fat guy. <laughs> pop up power bomb. <laughs> oh my god! Oh what a no! Oh, he's right back up for another. No, he's right back up. Ah, oh, he's got the counter. The knee is in. Skuro fired up. If he could get a pop up now, he might have this because no crush would be found. No. Oh my oh, god. Oh no, he's just. You fucking knocked him out. <laughs> and Skuro sending him into the corner. J5 calling for the tag. J5 getting the tag. Big move coming here. Look out, oh. Crusher. Uh, excuse me, EAB. 
That was a huge move. They sent him into the turnbuckle. Yeah, massive. <laughs> <laughs> Crusher yeah, in, but a two-count kick out anyway. Skuro just hanging out. <laughs> <laughs> oh, what a disaster tonight! Oh, J5 been... <laughs> gonna, I thought J5 was gonna shoulder block Skuro off. Oh, Skuro! Oh, he's looking up. Oh, oh no, J5! Oh, J5! No, oh, J5! You're at the wrong corner, and you're the oh, legal man. God. You didn't tag out. Oh god! Oh god! Crush oh, is no. confused. <laughs> at least the ref isn't counting. Oh god! Oh, and EAP is up. How did he manage? Oh, J5, this is a mistake. Oh, oh no. Oh, J5, in the nick of time, EAB got to him on the top rope there. Oh. Into the huge superplex. I think it's Oh, no. Oh, the well, the real. winner three fives had a lot of, of momentum, and I think that might have just killed it. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, me too, <laughs> Oh, J5 back in! Look at this! With the pin attempt! Oh, crush it. Not even quick. a one count! Crush it right there! But Skuro gonna make him pay! Oh, oh wow. my goodness! What a move from Skuro! <laughs> that was a crossroads, I think. Oh, shake, rattle, and roll! Oh, uh, well, this hasn't worked out for him too often in the past, <laughs> but. Crusher not in the ring. He could go for a pin here. Or just this stomp on him. This could be it. He looks like he really wants to go for that curb stomp. Yeah. No. Nope. Sends him into the corner. Crusher stirring. Is he going to tag in uh, Skrull? No, he can't get to him. No. <laughs> He's going to... Oh, boy. Oh, boy. <laughs> Hey, he, he, fig he figured it out. He's going for a very late pin. Oh, still two count, count again. No way he could have ever gotten a three count out of that one. <laughs> oh, he's jumping around. Oh, oh dear. Oh, dear, the this brain is, worms. There's something going wrong here. This is far too much calisthenics for J5. <laughs> yep, there we go. That's what we expected. <laughs> what a disaster a night has been. <laughs> I don't know oh what you're talking God. about. We gotta make this work. We gotta make this work, Jimmy. <laughs> oh, there's the elbow. Oh, no. Skrull, get in there. Oh, J5 oh, kicked out. What the hell? Out. At least they're giving us a show. But Skrull could not get there. Crusher, very good on defense. Holy it's like shit. he's got frenzy or something. <laughs> yeah. Certainly doesn't have wild animal. No. J5 has a real shot here to be a hero. Oof. A second one of those moves, and finally, J5 gonna fly. That's what's been missing. Top, Top rope, rope Johnny. Johnny. Woo. Oh, he drives his head right into the fucking robot. <laughs> Crusher the right Crusher there. able to break it up. That ad to have been it. Skuro is fucked. <laughs> You've got away with words, Gorilla. <laughs> <laughs> oh, J5 stuff. really fired up now. Look at him go. He's going Again. right back to the top rope. Can he do it? Two for two. <laughs> no, he does all of his weight. Cannonballs down onto him. And again. <laughs> 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 ah, top rope Johnny, we haven't seen this level of high flying from him in a long time. <laughs> three for three, let's see it, J5. Oh, shit. He's done it. <laughs> Skurro's up on his feet, but Crusher's right there. Oh, my God. Oh, the two count kick out again. Oh, my God. <laughs> 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 oh boy, and now is he going to tag in Skurro to hopefully, no, EAB counters out, punches Skurro on the side, <laughs> and EAB might escape out of this one, he yeah. does, tags in Crusher, this match is going to continue, look out J5. Brilliant. <laughs> <laughs> oh 
Boom. And J5 looking very smartly going to tag in Skuro. Skuro's yep. had some time to rest, but he was pretty hurt earlier. Has he got enough to end this match? He's got him by the horns again. Ride him, cowboy. <laughs> Walk around menacingly, cowboy. <laughs> All right, well, he, he's, he's going with what's working, folks. He's going with what's working. <laughs> Oh, and literally nothing else is. Oh no, look at this! Wait. He's going for a submission? No, he's he's won matches with that before though. Yeah. <laughs> yeah, maybe, maybe J5. We need to ask the experts out of field. <laughs> <laughs> Oh, look out. Oh, that's girl's good knee, too. Ooh. Ooh. Not anymore. <laughs> oh, oh but right back in with the uppercut. Beautiful uppercut to a guy that's like a two and a half feet taller than him. <laughs> and he gets him up for the shoulder breaker. Pump yeah. handle shoulder breaker. Is he going for the pin? Nah. <laughs> nah. <laughs> Come on. <laughs> Come on. <laughs> He'll pin him when he's damn well ready to pin him. He's got to work that hand over to get him ready for the pin. <laughs> this looks stupid, being Skuro being half the size of Crusher, but there you go. Oh, here, oh, we, here go. we go. Though. Surely he can't get him up for a for a pop up power bomb. Surely not. No, oh, he's done it. Oh my it. god. J5 and here's J5 straight right in. in there. EAB. Oh my no, god! Two count kick out again! Oh my god! Crusher kicked out. EAB was intercepted just barely by J5. This girl gonna go for a second one, and surely oh, this has got to be it. Surely this has got to be it. He's got him as far away from EAB as he can about get him. The yeah. EAB. No one even Not tried. even in the ring. <laughs> Skuro gets the win with J5. The winner, three fives victorious in their redemption match. And it looks like maybe through this huge war of attrition, those two might have figured out a thing or two about a thing or two and could be right back in the scene. Glorious. What Booty. a match. Really making up for last week's... Uh, 11 second count out, that's for damn sure. Yeah. Bit of brain worm still, but they're a new tag team and learn it. And there they are, victorious over Crusher and EAB, who are now 0 and 2. And you gotta you gotta wonder how much longer they can uh they they, they, they can keep going as a pairing with that kind of record. Yeah, there's I mean you wouldn't believe it, would you? EAB and Crusher are two absolute monsters and they've just done Absolutely. <laughs> J5 not wanting to climb the turnbuckles, expend the energy to celebrate. Skuro making it happen, though. But there they are. Glorious. What a what a win for those guys. Whew. Boy, howdy. Finally, it only, it only took us one and a half shows. We got a good match. Yeah, brilliant stuff. And now get ready for an even better one. Mrs. Wanger, one of the greatest of all time in the JFW women's division, facing Wendy, who was victorious last week over the uh, the newcomer and the blue chipper trend. Wendy calling out Mrs. Wanger and getting the answer, and they're going one-on-one -on -one in the middle of the ring next. Glorious. Should be, should be a wild one. <laughs> Mrs. Wanger is a drag queen. No, she's just literally married to Wanger. <laughs> That's it. <laughs> yeah, well, maybe a little bit. And here she is. Is she going to rise out of the ring like her husband? <laughs> it is Wendy. McNaughton, I mean, Ka Wendy Cal Kaz. <laughs> Whatever she's called, she's here to kick some ass. She did it last week against Trent, and she's looking to pound more ass tonight. Now, wait. wait oh, my God. Wait a second. Is that? That's. 
It's Trent. Trent's got a sledgehammer. She's got that potato <gasps> smasher in her hand, and she drives it right into the kidneys of Wendy Tren, out mm, for vengeance mm. for spoiling her uh, her stand firm debut. And look at this! Wow, <laughs> all over Wendy here. Tren has ambushed uh, Wendy, <laughs> and uh, this might this might be over before it ever begins. I don't think Mrs. Wanger's coming out anymore. We've got a brawl here. Tren versus Wendy continues. Holy moly. Where else but on Friday, Stan Firm, do you see this roster of women's wrestlers? <laughs> We've got Tren and Wendy and Mrs. Wanger amongst many thousands of others. <laughs> oh, look at this! <laughs> Doing a push-up. So amazing. Showboating a little bit there. That's amazing. Hey, hey, fame here. Oh, oh, and wow. that'll do Instant it. Wendy win. never stood a chance. Yeah, Trent. That was uh, the most brutal side of Trent I think we've seen here. Trent yeah. coming out, ambushing Wendy, and getting the big, <laughs> getting the big uh, comeuppance, I guess, for last week. Yeah. Well, that that's it. That's oh my god, it's all gone wrong. <laughs> I don't know what you're talking about, but we've got an elimination <laughs> match on next. I thought there'd be a celebration, so I was waiting for that, and then the uh, menu came up, but it's all right. <laughs> Fair enough. Yeah, next up, triple threat match. Frost Lord Army, uh, <laughs> Tony plays poorly, and Night Demon all going at it. You know, Frost Lord Army won a huge match last week against Night Demon to earn himself a spot at Backlash uh, in a match of my choosing. And, uh, well, I'm, I might choose one of these two men. Let's see if he pins either of them in this match. Pinning either of them would surely be uh, a, uh, a line on a championship matchup against either the world title uh, and former partner of uh, Frost Lord Armies or against Night the man who almost murdered him in Hell in the Cell a year and a half ago, Night Demon. Oh dear. Alright, so let's go. Mega, mega, mega triple triple threat. That was Wendy J5. <laughs> it was Wendy J5. <laughs> it was a potato smasher, L O D. Yes, it was a potato smasher, yep. You know, that's what most people own in their kitchens to smash potatoes with. <laughs> yeah, obviously. Obviously. <laughs> oh god. <laughs> Who doesn't know that? All the things that we got in sync over. Here he is, the man of the hour, looking to uh, place himself in the ranks of these two great champions he's about to face. Will he get himself a Wemdope title shot? Will he get himself a world title shot? What else could be in store for Frost Lord Army? Yep. The fourth favorite, it's a it's a three-man match, Frosty. Yeah, that's, that's, that was the joke. That was the joke, Gorilla. <laughs> I know, I know. Sometimes you need someone to sell it. I know, I know, I know, Frosty. But, uh, you know, former, like, don't be the kind of guy that just sits there talking about his former achievements <laughs> like they matter anymore in the modern day. You don't want to, you don't want to be someone like that. You want to be a true champion, a guy like Skirmetto, a three-time <laughs> SFL champion, the current reigning champion of the SFL. That's who you want to be like, not some has-been or whatnot. Dear. Not everyone J5. <laughs> God, I'll have to work it all out at some point. Sk Skuro is barely a champion. <laughs> Skuro, Skuro might be the least the least champion of everyone in the JFW if you could believe it. One one full day of uh, title reign for him. Mm. 
Oh boy. Big, Big match, match Tony. Tony. And of course, you know, former partners with Ross Lord Army and Mighty AF, but as we learned just a few weeks ago at WrestleMania, there could not be more of a uh, more of a <laughs> More of a moved on phase for Tony Blaze Poorly from his Mighty AF days. He is your JFW World Heavyweight Champion, and he's doing it on his own. He's selling all the t-shirts. He's getting all the phone calls from Hollywood. He is buying us all the video games to make this stuff happen. <laughs> he is pay to win Tony Plays Poorly. Oh, yeah. <laughs> oh. What was that? What? It just randomly sounded like you had an orgasm. <laughs> that is not what it sounds like, believe me. It just went, ah. Uh. <laughs> no. I just, I just like yawned a bit. Oh, it was a yawn. Okay. It was a yawn enough. with a stretch that made it sound a bit weirder. <laughs> <laughs> uh, Night Demon, the smart one so far, not taking the hits, gonna uh, celebrate and then, oh, go right after. Yeah, look at that. No, Frost Lord. Nope, never mind. Nope. <laughs> nope. It's always hard to tell with Night Demon who's got the offense until the, uh, the back hits the bat. <laughs> Glorious. <laughs> no, I won't Best give hits. in. Until well, I guess I'm we shouldn't victorious. commentate for a while, huh? And I will defend. Oh my god. I will defend. Well, thank you very much, Physics. Unbelievable. Absolutely. Tell me when glorious. it's over. I will do. Glorious. <laughs> no, this I just in, Physics in. getting himself a title. Until I'm victorious. And <laughs> I will defend. Boy, howdy. Oh my god, big miss from Night Demon. Glorious. No, I won't give the in. Until I could I'm do, could not. Yeah, I'll do that. I'll do it's that. up to you. I don't want to take it away from physics, I will but defend. I want to talk over him. Yeah, yeah. I'll try and try and do it here. I think it's this. Here we go. There we go. Thank you very much, physics. <laughs> Thank well, you physics, very much. If you, if you knew what stream to do that in, you could be an SFL champion right now. But unfortunately, <laughs> no. <laughs> I don't think Jimmy has any championships to dole out for you. <laughs> Wait a second, that's physics music. <laughs> <laughs> oh, dear. No. oh, Night Demon did not plan that one well. Crossbody into a bunch of punches by Tony. Oh, and Night Demon sent in the ring. Tony pursuing and looks like the two champs. Nope, Frosty wants... Frosty oh knows. my god, oh, he just wants well. to jump on the ground. <laughs> I was just about to say, Frosty knows he's got to impress, but now it feels hollow saying that. <laughs> oh my god, this is, this is elimination, this extreme rules elimination, by the way. <laughs> oh, and here we go, now, Frosty, this could be smart by him, roll out, recover, let the two champs wear each other down, maybe even eliminate one of them, then that, that's half your work done. Yeah, yeah, thank you very, very much, Physics, absolutely glorious. Thank you so much. And of course, as someone who gets paid 50% of all subs that come in during <laughs> Stand Firm, thank you, Physics. <laughs> <laughs> thanks again, Gorilla. <laughs> <laughs> oh, oh, the thanks is all I really need. We're good, we're good. Oh, look at that. Nice Luthes press by Tony oh, Plays Poorly. And congratulations again to your oh, good no. friend Skirometso on all of his SFL titles. <laughs> <laughs> oh, no. Oh, stun oh, it, stun it, stun That it. could be it for... No! Oh! He might have caught a huge break there. Caught the stunner, but Night Demon could not resist going after Tony when he was distracted. And oh, now... Man. Oh, whoa, this Taking advantage of the stunner. Oh! Yes! He kicked out, thank Christ. <laughs> That sure would have uh, made things, made our jobs a little more difficult. Yeah. <laughs> Fair enough. <laughs> oh, brutal maneuver. This could be it for uh, Frosty. This could be it. No, he kicks, no, he out, kicks again. out again. 
He really needs a reprieve here. He's taking a ton of damage. The two champs teeing off on him and looks like he might get it. Oh no, no, he thought he saw fit to punch a Tony. That that was <laughs> probably not the best strategy. <laughs> <laughs> Gorilla <laughs> gets nothing. Gorilla gets Gorilla gets the glory, guys. Gorilla gets yeah. the glory. Yeah. Oh. Oh, look out. Oh, Ropes boy. all over. Oh, he caught his head on the rope. You can see it. Night Demon got really snapped there by that rope. Uh -oh. Defying physic. Uh oh. Still now, in for Night Demon. Yeah. It, it sure is. Is someone going to pin him? No, Frostlord doing the same thing Night Demon did earlier. That might save him, but nice toss by Frosty. Will he oh, pin? oh, Frosty! Pedigree. If he hits this on Tony, that could be it for Tony. It could be. Wouldn't that be something? Oh. Frostlord, he's got the pin on Tony. Is that it? No. No, two count kick out. And now Frosty's got to watch his back. He is definitely not, and that is why. Oh, what a maneuver. It spits blood at him, bro. Oh, my God, Tony's done. Look at that. I know. He kicked out. He, had, he used everything he had left to kick out. But Frostlord coming back here. But he's got two guys to contend. What is Tony doing? Nice spine buster by Frosty. He's getting and punched then, oh, in the face like, now. Yeah, Tony was about to pop a squat and take a shit, it looks like. <laughs> and instead, he's getting shat upon by Frostlord. Oh, Frosty oh, with a bad. Oh, look at this. He might tap him out. He, he could might? legitimately tap him out right now. No, Tony punching furiously. <laughs> nice, nice Come roll on, out by Frosty. <laughs> Looked like he separated his shoulder there. Yeah. It's about time for a zombie, isn't it? I can't believe we haven't seen one yet. There we I go. I know. That's the, oh, there he is. <laughs> <laughs> well, there you go. And right into the pin on Tony. And I'm like, ooh, he's being Two pedigreed. Two count, kick out zombie. again. Oh, Frosty's so slow. He, Night Demon could pin them both right now. He could. And look at this, deadlift and right up and down. Frosty in trouble, but here comes Tony. Oh, wow. Tony, whoa, the pin on Night Demon. Just a one count. Holy moly. Frosty finally back to his feet. Oh, wow. That was a uh, good ring awareness by Tony. But Frosty fired up by it, saying no thank you. And look out. Has him hung up on that middle rope and just strangling, strangling him, forcing the air out of him. And Tony has to roll out to catch his breath. And now, look out, Night Demon. Straight right hook. Oh, no. Oh, boy. Look at this. Reverse choke slam. Oh, oh that's got to be it. It that's could gotta be. be it. Oh, the pin. <laughs> He's oh, got it. God. He's got it. Absolute execution style on Night Demon. Oh, Frostlord has just pinned Night Demon. He's 2 0 oh against Night Demon on stand firm now. And surely that Wemdope title's got to be in his sights. But what if he pins the world champ, too? Boy, howdy. That'd be something. That sure would be something. It's a pretty cool pin, isn't it? Yeah. <laughs> and the two former teammates, the two armed services guys. <laughs> guys. <laughs> going at it once again. Tony plays poorly and Frostlord. Yeah. Oh. And he's looking like Flicky Flack there running right into that pole. <laughs> <laughs> oh, here we go. Indeed, muscles him down, straight piss. Oh no, I think I saw some blood. Yep. Yep, yep. Frosty's bleeding, and that could be it for him. 
<laughs> no, two count kick out again. <laughs> this is I'm just. Oh, he's <laughs> trying to pull his mask off. Oh, wow. Tony trying to humiliate his former friend and partner. <laughs> I'm just laughing at the armed services guys. <laughs> <laughs> uh, Here we go, well, Oh, he tosses it no, off! the counter! He knew it was coming, he countered it, but can he do anything with it? Amazing. Doesn't look like it. Wow. Don't believe it. Counted the stunner. Oh. Oh, that's brutal. Raking him across. Yeah, that mask definitely obviously providing no protection against those uh, <laughs> duct tape wrapped ropes. Yep. <laughs> Oh, here we go! Oh, pedigree, this. this could be it. What, what, what a turnaround this would be if he can hit this pedigree and get the pin. He's got it's him. Good. Can he get the pin now? Surely. Flips him over. This has got to be it. Tony's taking a ton of damage, but he is Tony. And no, Frostlord's beating the bull. Frostlord Army two and zero on Stamp Firm. He's at the top of the pile, folks. He's got a guaranteed match at Backlash, and he didn't make my job any easier. Now I gotta figure out how to handle that. He can pick any belt he wants. Oh, Unbelievable man. stuff. <laughs> Get off my fucking pitch, prick. <laughs> what a match. Frost Lord Army victorious once again. Standing tall, and folks, that was that would be main event caliber, but we've got a title match in our main event next. It is gonna be dressed for business, defending their newly won two heads championships. That's Fanfox and Lemon is Good. Yep. Versus Kadenik and Try, isn't it? <laughs> yes, it was. I was, I was pausing again for, uh, <laughs> for drama's sake. I definitely didn't forget who won the opening match. <laughs> well, I made a sexy graphic for it, so there you go. If you have the stream oh, there, oh, well, yeah. Oh, see. nice. Very good. I thought I heard some clicking in the background. And mm. next up, this tag match is going to be something, folks. Absolutely glorious. Yep. Who's going to win the main event of Friday night? Stand firm. Well, if you're asking me, I got a little bit of bias here. I got to root for my my home brewed stand firm tag team here even if they are two fucking weirdos <laughs> i gotta go for howdy nick and try yep. here we go this is stand firm hancock we give you new pairings and wait, what what the fuck what is that how did he what the hell is he doing i don't know what's going on here we've got President and Commissioner of the JFW, Mr. Jim McMahon, in the ring for some reason. He's got a mic. Ah, oh, Jesus. Well, God damn it, JFW. If you think that you're going to have the tag team titles defended on Stan Firm Gorilla Mezzo, you've got another thing coming. Because I've given the tag team champs the rest of the week off after their grueling match on Monday. You'd better get used to not having tiles on Friday Night Gorilla. Maybe Skuro Mezzo can buy some of them for you in future for your shitty show. Anyway, that's about all I've got to say. I, 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 I've not really thought this through very much, but uh, <laughs> that's the end of the show, shitheads. See ya. Can, can he just can he just do that? Can he just end our show? He's not. I guess I guess he just has. Yeah, I guess he just has, folks. I I, I guess I'm sorry. I, our main event is. I I gotta go. This is this is infuriating. I I, I gotta get out of here. Oh man, well that's it. Um, <laughs> what can I say? Um, thanks for watching, everyone. Thanks, Gorilla. Don't forget to leave a like and subscribe and stay fantastic.